A simple daily thermodynamic process is boiling water on the stove. You experience this process whenever you do something like cook pasta. A container is first filled with some water, preferably a container that allows for easy transfer of heat from the stove flame to the water. The stove combusts the gas which creates a controlled flame. This flame begins to transfer energy from itself to the pot which then begins to transfer energy from itself to the water. For the boiling to occur, the water must undergo the process of phase change. This phase change process requires a lot of energy, which the flame provides. The amount of energy required for water to boil is about 440 calories per gram of water. The process itself is also highly dependent on the atmospheric pressure. The amount of pressure on the water surface correlates with the amount of energy required in order for evaporation to occur. The amount of energy needed is proportional to the temperature the water must reach to evaporate. For example, at the top of a mountain, the atmospheric pressure would be less than at sea level, which means less energy would be required and therefore lower temperature for the water. As soon as the energy source is removed, the reaction subsides and eventually stops. This is due to the fact that no longer is enough energy being absorbed by the system to overcome the atmospheric pressure in order to evaporate. And that was the simple thermodynamic process of boiling water.